a Paloma, a Bee's Knees, a Manhattan, Tom Collins, a Mai Tai. What do these have in common? They're all classic cocktails, and we're paying tribute to them today, coming up on I Want to Try That, Cocktail Edition. Hey guys, welcome back to my kitchen. Today's a very special day here at I Want to Try That. I feel like I always say that. It's always special. It is. Uh, today, <laughs> today really is special because we actually have a live audience. Say hello, ladies. <laughs> and um, they have graciously agreed to come and I guess be our guinea pigs or yes. taste testers. Exactly. And um, yeah. yes. So we have five drinks that we're going to be doing. We're doing a Paloma, which is tequila. Mm -hmm. Bees Knees, gin. And a Manhattan, which is rye whiskey. Tom Collins, also gin. And a Mai Tai, which is an aged rum with a rock candy, simple syrup, and orgeat, which is an almond liqueur. Yes. So it should be really good. It's delicious. So enough talking. Let's get drinking. Okay, so the first drink we're doing is a Paloma, and that's a tequila drink, and Michelle, that's your favorite drink. Right. <laughs> yeah. She loves it. Okay, so let's get started. Um, we're gonna, actually, I'm gonna start with the uh, juice okay. first. So, grapefruit juice. I need, um, what do I need? Eight ounces, so. Oops, the glug, yeah. Two. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> okay, eight ounces of freshly squeezed <laughs> grapefruit juice, and then we also need four ounces of lime juice, so that's two, and four, and then my agave right here. Yep. And then we need two ounces of agave. Which I love. Yes. Great, and a margarita. Yeah. And then I'm gonna stir it. If you can then, after I stir it, put some yep. ice. Yep. I just wanna make sure that the, the uh, agave blends into the juice. Put some ice in the shaker. And then we need eight ounces of Blanco tequila. That means white. Yes, white. All those like seven years of Spanish if you want. <laughs> I gotta count. Oops. That's four. Yes. This is six. And one more. Eight. Wow. I was always good at my twos. Yes. <laughs> the other ones, seven. All right, and then stir it again. And then I'm gonna pour. So I'm gonna leave a little bit on the top so I can put some club soda. Okay. All right. It is, I've had it many times. <laughs> it seems like just yesterday. Like an hour ago. <laughs> Okay, and then we're gonna garnish with a grapefruit wedge. Do you have the lime too? Yeah, if you can try to scrounge a couple up. I think I think Michelle's a little camera shy. Is there anybody else? Oh, oh Valerie. Okay, All come right. on, girl. All right, right, there you go. That's this you. One? This one. Yep. Okay. You got? Okay. All right. This one. It's so pretty. Yes. Cheers. Cheers. Looks mm. refreshing. It is. It is. It's oh my very gosh, good. It's so good. I think it's delicious. It's so good. It is yummy. Oh my gosh, this is my new drink. Yeah. <laughs> well, you guys will all get a sample, so. Alright, so what's the next drink? 
bee's knees. Woohoo! Yeah. All right. Okay, so it's gin because you know I love gin. And yes. this is actually not a bad gin. What's that? It's bulldog gin. Oh, it's is it kind a of inexpensive London, but delicious? Yeah, London, London dry. dry. Perfect. It's good. All right. All right. So we're gonna make four. Mm -hmm. There's already ice in here, and we're gonna use eight ounces. Okay. For four. One. Eight. All right. Now we're gonna use some honey syrup. It's basically simple syrup. It's just made with honey. So you just do half and half, and you can get it nice and warm, boiling a little bit, and then you just turn it off, let it cool. Actually, we have some uh, video of her making the simple syrup. So take a look. Okay. So we're making the honey simple syrup. Right now, I have one cup of water in my pot, it's getting close to boiling. I'm gonna go ahead and put one cup of the honey. So it's equal parts and it can be any kind. I just happen to use it in this kind. A little bear, that's so cute. So, very similar to making regular simple syrup, which is just with water and sugar, equal parts. This is just honey and water, equal parts. So you can make however much you want, really. This doesn't take as long as the simple syrup when you have the granulated sugar because it dissolves much quicker. I'm gonna get to a boil and then we'll turn it off. Okay, here come the bubbles. It looks pretty dissolved. That really ought to do it. You just have to turn it off, set it off the heat, and then let it cool before you put it into your container. And then we'll make the drink. Okay. So we're gonna use six ounces okay. of this. I like it sweet. Yeah. Mm. Who are the gin drinkers here? Anybody? I drink enough gin for everybody. <laughs> <laughs> I okay. love gin. It, you know what? Me too. Everybody's gonna love gin after this. Yeah. yeah. All right. Gin is actually similar to vodka. The only difference is when they distill gin, they put the juniper berry, they put botanicals. botanicals in it while they're distilling. Oh, so wow. it's so the if same you like thing. Vodka, you oh, should just like gin. That's right. Yeah. I always feel like I'm eating. Because if you put trees. yeah vodka, if you put anything in it, you might as well be drinking gin and you waste your time on putting things in vodka. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So the next thing is lemon juice. This is fresh squeezed. I did it before I got here, and oh, we're just gonna use. Um, a half an ounce per drink, mm -hmm. so that's two. Yes. All right. Now we're just gonna pop this on. That's it. Shake. Just the three. Just ingredients. those three things. Mm -hmm. See? But it's easy, really, it's easy. really good. You can try this at home. And she has cute little bees. Did you see the little so bees? Cute. Oh my gosh! Yes, the little candy, bees. little candy bees. Yes. Oh, yeah. Yes. It's like a baking thing. Amazon. You know, you put Amazon. it on cake. Yeah. Yeah. I was gonna put like one or two little rosebuds in there. Okay. These do like flowers. Yeah. Little, and little these flowers. these are just edible flowers. You can eat them if you want. They make tea out of them. You can also get that on Amazon. Okay, who would like to come up and try a bee's knees? I'll give it a shot. Come on, right. Fanny. That's okay. you. This is lovely. And that one will be the beauty shop. Okay. All right. All right. Cheers. Cheers to you, ladies. Cheers to you. Let's see. Mm. This is the bee's knee. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty good. It's great. It is. It's very good. It's mm -hmm. You can taste the lemon, but you also get the honey. I don't yeah. taste the gin. Do you taste yeah. gin? No, and you know, and I'm not a fan of honey, but this is delicious. Yeah. Just yeah. wait for it on the gin. Yeah. Wait for it. <laughs> oh, it's it's going to slap me upside the head. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> okay, so the next drink is a Manhattan, which is like a beautiful town. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're going to be using uh, rye whiskey. Sometimes you use bourbon, but the classic uh, Manhattan is rock. So that's what we're gonna do. Okay. And this is a real boozy drink. So like Valerie. That's exactly yeah. what we need. <laughs> so get ready for it. Okay. So we need, I'm gonna look at my yeah. 
<laughs> and then I'll get my cheat sheet. We need eight ounces. So I have a shaker with some ice in it. So we need eight ounces of this. So two, two, we have to math. Four. Okay. Now, is there anybody out there that drinks whiskey? Oh, oh, I <laughs> me! Me! And then we're gonna mix in some sweet vermouth. There's dry uh, vermouth and sweet, so. This is the sweet one. Need Martini four. and Rossi. Remember those commercials? Oh yeah. Do you remember so the commercials nice. from the 70s? Yep. Yeah. Isn't it so nice? Yes. Okay, and this four. one we need four. So, two. God, I'm so, I need those quick speed pours that Paul has. I know. We gotta get some. So, and this is a mess here. Okay. okay. And then we need some aromatic bitters. And that one is eight dashes. Okay. Yep. One, two, three, six, seven, eight. eight. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Who do we appreciate? <laughs> Alcohol. Okay. And then we need um, four, well, this is droppers. It says dashes, but I have a dropper. Okay, yeah. four drops, so not the whole like dropper. dropper. What is it? This is orange bitters. Oh. Okay, so. So aromatic bitters and yeah. orange bitters. One, two, three, four. What? Well, that was a big one. <laughs> it wanted to grow on. Yes. <laughs> I really feel like it should be more than that, but it's whatever. Nice. And that is it. Now we, where's my stirrer? Stir? I just have it. Right I did here. just have it. Thank you. <laughs> Look at it quick. That's my, <laughs> that's my thing. Oh, and then the glasses. Right. So this uh, is a stirred drink, not shaken. This is my second stirred drink, right? Right. You got it? Okay. Okay. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Yes. And these are um, sweet, not maraschino. They're like Luxardo, but... Or filthy. Yes, Cherries. but I got wood for the reserve. Okay, they're all delicious. Yeah. All right. I don't know, you could put them on ice cream and they would be amazing. Okay. Uh, Raquel! Raquel! Here comes Raquel New York. Who Raquel. loves whiskey? She wants Manhattan. Yes. I want to go to New York. Can okay. You want to grab right. that okay. one? Sure. I feel like I got cheated. Hold on a second. Wait, this one doesn't. <laughs> you want to pull it Yeah, Okay, there. Okay. All right, cheers. Cheers. Let's cheers. 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 Let's right. see. Right, I'm going to watch Raquel. <laughs> It's smooth. I didn't get the papau. Well, that's the. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like the papau? Because I need a little more. Um, I think it's the sweet vermouth that like cuts into the harshness of the the whiskey. There it is. There it is. Papau. Very good. Very good. I like it. But I feel so like elegant. Yes. It's, when it's drinking just a very sexy drink. drink. It's very sophisticated. Yeah. Very <laughs> I really wouldn't drink this quickly. No, this is definitely a sipping, sipping drink. <laughs> sipping drink. I got it now. So, I think I need, I think I need, I need my cherry. Get back. Yeah, go, go for it. <laughs> Cheers. So, a, another gin drink? <laughs> you know it. <laughs> What's this one? This one is a Tom Collins. I was looking up this cocktail and it said, if you ever meet somebody named Tom Collins, just go up and hug him. He'll know why. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, so let's start with Jen. Of course. Why not? All right, so we're making four, uh -huh. so we're gonna use eight. Eight ounces. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh God, I'm like really feeling the alcohol now. <laughs> not me! <laughs> <sighs> and this is eight. Okay. All right, now we're gonna go for the simple syrup. Okay. I cheated and bought some at the store. <laughs> okay, so this is one ounce a piece, so we're gonna do four. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. And then we're gonna get some lemon juice, also fresh squeezed. You might notice that this is very similar to the bee's knees. It's not the same. No, it's not. Don't even think about it. <laughs> okay, this is a one, one ounce of drink. So we're doing four again. Okay. Okay. And we have ice in that shaker. Right? Yes, there is ice in there. Promise. That's a lot of math. It, it is. It, it 
towards yeah. the end, yep. we're just like throwing it. Yeah. <laughs> the, well, we wrote it down this time, and we oh, still oh are, I, I, and we're still name. questioning ourselves. So. Right. Okay. <laughs> and what about this? That goes on the top. Okay. And what are we doing? Just like a splash of this on top? Just fill her up. Okay. I went a little crazy with oh, that one. Yummy. I'm not gonna lie, that one's a well, that high. one's yours then. It's <laughs> a little high. <laughs> there you okay. go. Back out a little bit. All right, and then we're gonna put a lemon. Oh my, I don't even know how we're gonna put a lemon on this one, but okay. <laughs> and then we're putting in cherry. I like this because it's super easy. This is like a fruit Look salad. Look how fruit salad. Fruit salad. Yes. <laughs> right. Yummy, yummy. Fruit salad. Okay. So who's coming up for the? Are you coming up, Shelly? No. No. Who's, who's coming up this one? one? Hello, uh, we need a volunteer. Come on. It's like nice and mixed. Here, give it that one. That's a pretty one. Okay, this is. I'll take this. One. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. Cheers. Cheers. All right. Cheers. Boys. All right. Let's see. How it's good. Kristen? Very refreshing. It Very is. Light. Looks refreshing. It's, it's like, like lemonade. lemonade. It is. Yeah, it looks like basically. Lemonade. Adult lemonade. <laughs> See, Even don't better. you love gin now? I love gin now. Right. Yes. So everybody's gonna get a sample, yes? Yes! yes. All right. Sure. Cheers. Yep. Cheers! Okay, so we're at uh, drink number five and we're doing a Mai Tai. Ooh. But we're doing Trader Vic's 44 from 1944. Original Mai Tai, which does not have pineapple juice or orange juice in it. But it's still very good. It has or jat, did That's I say right. that right? You did. I get, okay. <laughs> Which is an almond-like liqueur, and then it has um, barrel-aged rum, triple sec, rock candy simple syrup. Which is what? Rock candy and water. Wow. Actually, the original <laughs> recipe, he actually put rock candy in the shaker, but I was afraid it wouldn't, like, wow. dissolve. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so I just made the syrup. Uh, and lime juice, so. All right. Let's All right. get to it. Okay, so four servings. Oh, and I have my tiki glasses. I Super ordered these just for the drink. So cool. <laughs> yes. Okay, so I have a shaker with some ice in here already, and we're gonna do four servings. So it's eight ounces of the rum, and this just—it really smells really good. I like it. It's four. Okay, and one more. And, okay. And it's the real. This is the real McCoy. Actually, one of the when I was doing research, they actually recommended this one. The original one used some 17-year-old barrel-aged rum, which I don't even think you can find anymore. So, so use this. Right. <laughs> and then we need two ounces of the Orjat. Yes. Yep. Fancy. <laughs> it's from France. <laughs> is two. We just need two yeah, ounces two. of that. Yes. Just a little dabble do ya. And then triple sec, which we need two ounces of so that. Same. Yes. Two ounces of that, which is like orangey. And then one ounce of the rock candy. Rock. Yes. Yeah, and then the lime juice, we need four ounces. So this is two, and this is four. It's getting full. All right. Let's see. Shake it up. Now we shake it, shake it. Okay. I, yeah, I did two stir drinks. Okay. <laughs> All right. All righty. Yep, and you can garnish. I don't know why they use mint. It, it's not in the drink, but the garnish is mint. It looks pretty. With yeah. Long, yeah, it's supposed to look like a palm tree. Mm. Mm. That's what they said. Yeah, that's so what's the difference between this and like the newer Mai Tai? The newer Mai Tai has <laughs> pineapple juice and orange juice um. and a maraschino cherry. So it's garnished different. It's a maraschino cherry and a, a pineapple wedge pineapple juice and orange juice and everything else. Okay, and Val, you're coming up to try, yes? All right, so this one we'll put to the side for the shot. I'll take this one, you can have that one. All right, 
Cheers. Cheers. All right. All right. Whose tie is this? <laughs> My, My tie. tie. <laughs> it's good. Mm. Mm. It almost tastes like there's pineapple in it. I it know. Does. I think it's, it's the it's that, yeah. It really it's is good. good. Mm -hmm. All right, ladies, everybody's good. having a sample. Yeah. yeah. All right. Cheers. Okay, so here are our five classic cocktails. We have a Bee's Knees, a Manhattan, a Mai Tai, a Tom Collins, and a Paloma. I hope you guys try and enjoy these recipes. Please, give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Don't forget, subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on anything. And, as always guys, until next time, bye!